Stop scrolling, my love. Okay, I started doing another reading. I call on Archangel Michael, please return to sender any negative energy by thought, word, or action. The Nine of Wands, the King of Wands, the Knight of Cups. The King of Wands and the Knight of Cups are both in indecision, sorry. And then Judgment in Reverse and the Page of Pentacles. With the Nine of Wands, you need to let down your guard and know that you are protected. You are divinely protected. You are untouchable. There is no way that you can be fucked with. With the King of Wands and indecision, you also need to speak up. You are swallowing a lot of what you need to say, what you know you should say, and they're you're saying say it, be it, you know, like allow it to come out because it needs to come out. The reason why it's in your head is because it needs to be said. Otherwise, your guides wouldn't even put it in your head to begin with. So put it in, it's, it's there and make it come out, okay? You need to say these things. Um... And of course, these are the types of things that are free will, but like you need to be able to say them. If you want to accelerate, sometimes those things are tests. And sometimes those things are like, well, if we put the idea in their head to speak justice, will they actually do it? Can we trust them? Sometimes it's a test. Can we trust them to speak the truth? Speak the truth, my love, okay? With the Knight of Cups, continue to fill your own cup. Your cup comes first. Overflow your cup. You fill others and you give to others from the overflow of your cup. You don't tap into your own cup. Your cup stays full at all times, okay? So it's the overflow. You give from the overflow. Judgment in reverse, you are coming into a time of... Uh, I think I'm hearing like loving all, seeing the divinity in others. So if somebody is judging you, you're just like, that's cool. Like that's just where you are right now, you know? But the Page of Pentacles, a large windfall, you're, bringing, you're attracting it. You're attracting money. You're attracting the money right now. You're just bringing it in, bringing it in. The King of Cups. You love everybody everybody you love everybody and you show it through your actions you show it through like the reaching out the calls getting FaceTime but that could also be like actual in-person time you know um, a large one fall of money. What did I say? There's a large one fall of money coming your way. You have the five of wands in reverse. You are releasing all matters of like just if it if it doesn't align, then it's like cool. On to the next thing. That's really amazing. The ace of cups in reverse. I mean, sorry, the ace of cups. Just also like this this time of emotional fulfillment. This is a new beginning. This could also be a reading for the new year. Um, but also just like you, yeah, you knowing your worth. We have the King of Wands and Indecision, the King of Cups, and then the star here. And what I'm seeing here is that like things are going to start to come in even more if you're able to. <sighs> okay, so what I'm seeing here is that like you get these ideas and you're like, I should do it, but then you don't. And it's like, it's like my bed is comfortable, um, the couch is comfortable, and, the, and, and it's not that you're entirely uh, lazy or that you need to rest or anything like that. It's like your time of rest has, ha, was in the past, and now like Source wants to bring in like all of this incredible abundance for you, and you just need to act on it like literally you can't do anything wrong you are like the master alchemist um so you just need to come into a place where you're just like all right like i'm working you know um source will tell you when your guides will tell you when it's time to rest so they're saying go 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 until like I mean, it's like, okay, get your rest at night. Like, you'll be fine. You know what I'm saying? Um, the Two of Wands in reverse and the King of Swords in reverse. This is interesting. Can 
Can I get a clarifying card for these two, please? What are you saying? May I get a clarifying, please clarify? I am Master Prophecy. Okay, so they're saying here that the that's okay so you're getting downloads right so you're getting downloads like for foreshadowing not foreshadowing um foresight foresight that's the word so you're getting like you have foresight and you're getting these downloads but source is also saying these downloads are not set in stone this is just a timeline right like anything can happen, anything can change, any anything. So the source is saying, like, yeah, you get these downloads and everything, but they are meant to be manifestations that you work towards, but even then, it's like, but there's still something even bigger and greater there. Does that make sense? So work towards that thing, but there is still something more. I just saw 616, okay? So it's like the mirror, right? Like there's still something more. Work towards the manifestation, but it's not going to look exactly like the download. It's going to be better, okay? I'm also getting be mindful of who you share your manifestations with. If you are... Um, like I'm getting that soul family is coming in for you. And with this soul family, like you are absolutely like supposed to be sharing these manifestations with your soul family, right? But there are other people in your life who are not soul family, who are family, right? You are not to be sharing these manifestate or these downloads with them, these manifestations with them, because they're not soul family. They don't they are they're not at the same acceleration the same vibration as you are so um let me pull one more card here in this deck is there anything left to say here is there anything else to say here i guess not so i'm gonna pull i'm gonna just get one more clarifying card for this from this because I feel like it's here. Is there anything? Okay. So right here it says, I am fear and worry. Okay. The reason why, and this is, this is, I'm glad this came out. The reason why you don't want to share these downloads with everybody, I just saw 757, is because it changes the energy of the download and of the manifestation when you share it with people who are not a part of it, you know what I'm saying? Like, sure. Like if they're, if you are in partnership, you have a divine counterpart, you have, um, a partner, like a business partner, um, whoever your soul family is and is coming through as that is fine. If it is, if you know that the download is a part of them, if you know that the download has nothing to do with any of them, don't share it because it will, it will change the energy. Like say for instance, okay, I say, you know, I was thinking about going and getting ice cream tonight. Ooh, really? Like, I thought you said you were on a diet. Excuse me? Uh, no. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, can't like be, just be supportive, be nice. And that's the thing is that like that changes your whole tone around like I'm gonna go get ice cream tonight or I was thinking about going on a trip oh why would you want to go there or, you know like it, that could that could happen that could also not happen but the point is is that if it has nothing to do with the person that you want to do these things with don't share it if it has something to do with them share it because chances are they got the same download okay Okay, release all fear and worry. If you have any kind of fear and worry, go through the process of asking yourself why. Why am I afraid? I'm pretty sure, I am willing to bet that it has to do with the third dimension. Fear and worry exists in the third dimension, not in the fifth dimension. 
be divinely guided, divine inspiration, go for it. It's possible and it's happening and it's available because of your relationship with source and your guides. I love you. Keep going.